So this is what I mean with <laughs> finding parking space at the Uhasselt campus. Let's go. Now we are here at the main building. So I'm here today because I have a group meeting with uh, my chemistry group. Let's go, because I'm already a bit late. We have arrived to Hasselt main building. So now we've entered the main building. Let's get to our meeting. Okay, so we've arrived. Hmm? I need to sign something. Chase, yes. is the GPC working? Uh, I hope so. <laughs> Times can change. <laughs> okay, so we've arrived during the PRD meeting. This is a PRD group. PRD, PRD. And we're going to have a scientific meeting now. We've just finished the PRD meeting, all kinds of top secret stuff. So I'm now going with Jeroen to the office. And uh, I'm going to show him and Maarten how the website works. This is our office. Nicely new paint and a new floor. It's the first time I've been here. And this is my desk. Everything is still in a box and in the closet. Done. So this is my redecorated desk now. After everything was painted, a new floor, put everything back, put back the wall. The TEDx Hustle poster, TEDx conference that me and my team, you can see them here, organized back in the day. And a bit of the science communication articles of Hustle. So now let's work on the website. Okay, so I just figured out, I never told you what PRD stands for. It stands for Polymer Reaction Design Group. So it's a chemistry group that designs polymers and look at the different aspects of doing this. Okay, so this is Nuke and Erika. Hey, um, Did you guys just went for coffee? No, no, we discussed on. Uh, oh, you discussed <laughs> science. So this is Nuke. If she ever smiles at you, you're in big trouble. So that's correct. Then you're fucked. So <laughs> watch out for her. Okay, see you guys. Okay, so now that we're here, let me give you a quick tour. So welcome to Uhasselt, the main campus in Diepenbeek. This is my alma mater. I studied here for five years, doing a PhD now for three years. So welcome in the main building.
Okay, so Uhasselt has been around since 1971. It was known back then under another name, but since 2005 it is known as the U-Hasselt or Hasselt University. Uh, we are here now at campus Diepenbeek. There is also a campus in Hasselt, so campus Hasselt. We will be visiting that in another time, in another vlog, but today I will show you around at campus. So U-Hasselt is really a younger university. It's been around for approximately 45 years now. And that gives it an advantage. You study here with uh, short modules of learning certain courses and you have smaller groups that made it more interactive between professors and students. You're not a number here, you're actually a person and they interact with you, it's easier to ask questions and stuff like that. So there are many courses that you can follow here at Basel University, law, economics, medicine, hardcore sciences like mathematics, chemistry, physics but I chose for biomedical sciences. And that's because I'm fascinated by the human body. I've always been interested in how the human body works and how diseases in the environment can have an effect on our body. And that's why I studied biomedical sciences, because we study how our body functions. We study how disease works and we study how we can improve this whole. That's what we do as biomedical scientists. We're actually pioneers on the forefront of healthcare. But you cannot study or do science on an empty stomach, so let's check out the cafeteria. Welcome to the cafeteria. What are you eating? Oh, no. <laughs> it's a healthy salad. Is it a healthy salad? Healthy, healthy salad. That's how we biomedical students roll. Yeah, that's how we roll. Okay, so that was Hasselt University. See you next time on OMG at Science for another day of badass science.